Hi, Young Life Cloverdale supporters. It's Brenda Widener here, Area Director of Young Life Cloverdale, reporting live at Rockridge with some breaking news. I do have breaking news. It's not about Rockridge, even though we have the beautiful pinnacle and lake behind me, just up here visiting for the day. But I wanted to record some breaking news about our Young Life area, Cloverdale. And some of you will know, but my journey with Young Life Cloverdale goes all the way back to September 2000, when I moved as a university student to begin a Young Life club at Lord Tweedsmere, and to begin the Young Life area that eventually would get launched with me as its area director officially by 2005. So after 16 years of area directing in Cloverdale and 21 years of doing the ministry here, I am announcing a change. The change is not me departing from Young Life. I have been given a real privilege to step into the role of regional director for the Young Life Coastal Region. The coastal region is made up of the Lower Mainland and Vancouver Island. It's a role that opened up several months ago when Eric Keeler got promoted to vice president and which I've applied for after prayerful decision making to consider that this would be the right move for me in what God has next for me and my family and serving him in the ministry of Young Life. And I was thrilled to recently get the call to announce that I had the position. I started it formally on August 16th and I'm very excited to step into it and give leadership to reach all the kids in this huge geography. But it leaves the question of what happens to Cloverdale. And it's a question I've been wondering as I put my name forward to apply. And I am excited to have a second announcement is that we have hired Hannah Borthistle to be a staff associate in Cloverdale at 30 hours a week starting this September. You may recognize that Borthistle last name as her family. Her three older siblings have been Young Life students and campaigners and leaders and some of them have served as team leaders and both her parents have been just amazingly supportive over the years as well as serving stints on committee. So she comes with a great track record, both from her family, but also in her own leadership. As our team leader of Capernaum previously, she served in wildlife, and she'll be leading up our senior high work as we look to combine our clubs post-COVID with some of the downsizing that we've unfortunately seen with some of our momentum. And she's gonna be revitalizing that work to senior high, combining the clubs and investing in our leaders. She won't have the full weight of area director on her in this coming year. And so I will be retaining that oversight role at about 10% of my time to make sure things on the committee side, the finances behind the scenes are looked after. So Hannah can just be active with teenagers and leaders. We also have an exciting announcement. It's a bonus piece within this that Eric Tan has taken on the committee chair role and Rasmi Ling has transitioned out in her move to join and start the Delta committee. So for the three of us, Eric, Hannah, and myself will be taking on new roles, and we're so excited for what God has in store for each of us. On another note, I still will also be connected to Cloverdale in one more way. I've been serving as the wildlife team leader the last few years, and my heartbeat is to stay in that ministry, and that will be very insightful and inspirational for me in this higher leadership role to continue to have some feet on the ground directly with teenagers and young people. So we're, we're thrilled for these changes. It's a lot to announce. It's one big video, one big email. These changes are gonna to start to take effect uh, later this August and into September. But we just wanna take this moment to say thank you as supporters, partners, and teammates, whether you've been supporting and praying and giving towards us for the last six months, or for some of you, 16 or 21 years. We could not have done it without you, and we have such a great future in Hannah's leadership and other leaders partnering with us in this great committee and Eric and his leadership. So we just wanna say thank you. Thank you for partnering with me, the support you've given to me and Jack and my family, and I'm really thrilled in this new role that it involves caring and ensuring that great work continues in Cloverdale for a long time. So thank you. I look forward to connecting with you in the coming months, and we just are so excited with this news. And thank you for all your prayers and support of us during this great time of awesome and exciting transition. God bless, signing off from Rockridge.